One of the nicest features that I think about uh, the new oscilloscopes is that uh, I can take a USB stick and plug it in here. Now, we aren't quite sure, but we have these USB sticks formatted very small volume because that's what the scopes generally take. And we can plug this guy in here and we'll light it up. And at some point, it's going to tell us that it's connected in. If we come over here to storage, we can store and it'll save whatever's on the screen as a CSV. Uh, the data source is the screen, but we could select something else. Okay. Memory or screen. Parameters off. Let me see. CSV. So it saves it to an actual CSV file. You could sell it, save as a parameter. Uh, setups. I don't know what that is. Waves. I don't know what that is. Traces. Or a picture. You can save it just as a picture. We generally like to have it as a CSV file. So we'll set up as a CSV file. Okay. We will save it to disk management. I want to save it on my disk D, which is this guy. And I'm going to do a new file and I'm going to say OK. And now that's saving that onto that disk. And now it's saved as a CSV file, which for those of you who are uh, familiar, that's kind of like a spreadsheet. And so we can get that data off and read it in a program like MATLAB. So that's the best way that we have to get the data off. It's going to save exactly what's on the screen. If it saturates on the screen, it's not going to pick up those values. So you're going to want to make sure that everything on the screen is the correct value.